once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together, but one day, hunters took their dad away. Forever. So now the brothers were alone, and they had to find a new home. They started a journey through the great big forest. The wolf brothers wandered for days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. They slept in the backwoods among creepy creatures and barely ate anything. They eventually found a peaceful orchard and were able to eat in peace. But they didn't know. Hunters tried to tie them up, but the wolf brothers managed to escape with the help of a friendly bear. He showed them how to survive and helped them find a warm camp for the night. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. That's how they found themselves even further, headed to the faraway land of their pop, where they hope to find peace. It was too heavy for you a few days ago. Let's try to lift something else. Not too heavy, though. I'm a little tired. I'm so glad Daniel took this little girl with us. You could try and lift Mushroom? Are you kidding? I don't want to hurt her. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're probably right. Let's leave the puppy out of this. How about that one? I can do it with the small rocks, but not the big ones. You can do this. Trust me. Just relax. Focus. I'll try. Shit. I did it! <laughs> like a boss. You're getting good at you this. You see that mushroom? That was the biggest oh. rock ever. Oh. Is this one too big? Yeah. 
It's just way too massive. Can you throw this rock in the river? Oh, yeah. Just watch. Splash! Okay. Let's show Daniel some more stuff to play with before we call it a day. Dude, it's getting late and cold. Let's get done with this practice session. How about trying out that rock over there? Just one more time. We already tried yesterday. And the day before. It's too far. I can't reach it. Just one more time. Not your usual shooting range, right? How about those cans? Can you fly them all together without dropping any? Sure, look. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. You're getting way better at this. <laughs> Come on, dude. That's just the start. Let's try something else. Cool. You're like Coach Aaron. You're my power coach. A snowball fight? Not yet. This is a new exercise, young apprentice. See if you can stop this in the air. Cool? Okay, but you better not hit me. Like that time you gave me a bruise? Serious. You won't let me, right? Try it. Sorry, I thought you would stop it. Serious. Aw, <laughs> oh, that sucked. How about one more? Ready? <laughs> can do, Sean. I knew that you could. I've taught you well. But you, you're a master student. <coughs> hey, that still sounds nasty. <coughs> you're not getting better. I told you. I'm fine. Just a little beat. Well, you need to rest now. Superhero. Can we go back now? Yeah. Let's just fill up the canteens before we head back. That cough has been going on for days, Daniel. I really don't like that. I told you. I'm fine. We've just... Here we go. The hella tanker is over the wildfire zone. Get ready for water extraction. Ranger Diaz. Nice work, Daniel. Glad to see our training sessions are paying off. Thanks to you. So glad I don't have to touch that water. It's too fucking cold. Uh, oops. Sorry. I said fucking. <laughs> it's fine out here. There's no one to hear you curse. Say whatever the fuck you want. Cool. What, what did you find, Shroom? Oh, come on. Not again. We gotta leave these poor bunnies alone. Finding that house was a miracle. But I'm afraid we can't stay here much longer. Uh, Sean? Hey. It's been a while since we last saw that rabbit who lives in there. 
Yeah. I hope it wasn't eaten by a bear, or worse. What's worse than a bear in Nano? I don't know. Wolves? <laughs> don't worry. We're the only wolves around. <laughs> Cold. Don't worry. We'll make a fire. We're pros now. <coughs> Dude, that cough doesn't sound too good. Nah, uh, I'm okay. Just cold. You kicked ass today. Level up. I did. That was so cool. It's getting easier every day. Oh no, Sean. This is a haunted house. More like, uh-oh, it's time to go over the rules. I told you about showing off. I was just... Whatever. Dude, I know the rules. Let's find out. What's the first one? Uh, um... Hide your power. If you spin one plate in a diner, what happens? People will freak out. And when people freak, what do they do? They call the cops. Exactly. The second rule is... Don't, uh... Never talk about it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice, Daniel. Because that's usually the hardest rule for you. <sighs> Shut up. <laughs> and the final rule? I know... Come on. Um... You can do it. Okay. Um... Avoid danger? Run from danger. This is the most important one. You know why? Uh, I don't know. I mean, with my power, I can help us. Only as a total last resort. How will I know that? If there's any other way of helping, do that first. Maybe if I had used it before, Dad might still be here. Daniel, it's my fault. I shouldn't have let you alone outside. But I didn't help. I didn't do anything. Because you couldn't. <coughs> Don't worry, Mushroom. I'm okay. Good puppy. She must be hungry. What about you? I'm always hungry. <laughs> then let's grub out. I'll make us some dinner. Yeah, before she eats us. <laughs> Mecha robot ready for takeoff. Three, two, one. Hey, Shroom. You thirsty? <laughs> Good girl. I wish I helped Dad more with the house chores back then. The space scuba is hovering on a dead planet. What sadistic scheme do you have in mind today?
wish I had more than tobacco, to be honest. HQ, I'm flying over the city. No danger. There was a little bit left when we came. Pretty disgusting, but helps staying warm. Taking pictures. Tanya must have been pissed that day. Don't blame him. Put my lighter. Wish I had more than tobacco, to be honest. I wish I helped Dad more. The house chores back then. Hey, look! Our buddy Raccoon is back. I got my eyes on him. He stole mushrooms ravioli yesterday. <laughs> yeah. Next time. We're so lucky this thing is still working. Wouldn't have lasted long without E. <laughs> yeah. Next time we'll call the forest cops. You whiskered thug. I hate it when I hear Daniel crying at night. <sighs> I can't do shit. Of course. How can I feel bad for him? to get warm. Here we go. Hold on, Mushroom. We're gonna build a fire. Starving. Guess it's time to start cooking. Yum. Too bad I can't make a pizza fly to us. Mmm. Tough choice. Service. This hot dog man issue is. Better talk to Daniel better. after dinner. Hey, what are you cooking? Oh, I'm sorry. Here's your <laughs> menu choices ravioli. Or ravioli. This sucks. Why can't I'm so tired of eating food? the same shit. How you doing? I just want one slice of pizza. You're the best puppy in the world. I'm just glad we found you. Kim, these were all I found when I hit the town last week. This thing is strong as a rock. Hmm. This room is fucking cold, so we put everything we didn't need in it and what? keep it closed. You were published before you even born, Sean. We never found the key to this door. I guess using the sliding door is cool. He looks so serious on this picture. I still can't believe he's gone. I miss him so much, it hurts, Sean. I know, Daniel. It's okay to think about him. I do it too. Mm, okay. Thanks, Sean. Feels almost good to be cut off from everything. Haha. <laughs> 
That marsh burger totally looks like mushroom. Daniel needs to eat something after all that psychic crap. Hey, I put some clean water in the bathroom so you can wash a little. Dude, you'll be moving cars around in no time if you keep improving like that. Mm, you really did so? Well, that'd be a bad idea, but you sure are getting good at this. High school feels so far away now. Well, that'd be a bad idea, but you sure are getting good at this. I wonder if there's anyone else like me. Mm, I think we'd know it by now. Nah, it's not ready yet. I'm a ravioli. Nah, it's not ready yet. I'm a ravioli expert now. Okay, dinner's ready. Getting sick of ravioli. That was spaghetti a la tias. <laughs> Didn't you taste the famous truffle sauce? Yep. Plus, I love the garlic bread and ice cream. Yum. Ooh, you want some too, huh, mushroom? Bon appetit, mushroom. Man. She loves this stuff. <coughs> Sorry. I'm cool. Hold on. I need to show you something. Um, okay. Gotta show him the map. Uh, I think I left it with my books. This thing is strong as a rock. I wonder how far it can go. Mm. Nothing here. Daniel, what did you do with the map? Mm. What do you mean? You know what I mean. Where's the map that was with my stuff? I don't know. I'm not keeping track of your things. Daniel's been sick for more than a week. 
and it keeps getting worse. he put it? <sighs> okay, come on, doggy. Let's go, girl. Hey man, can you call your dog? I don't exist. Mushroom, come here girl. <sighs> what a great team. Time to play dad talk. Sean, there's someone at the door. What the? When did he show up? Mother f Daniel? <laughs> Got you! <laughs> Man, are you out of your mind? Oh, uh, come on. Don't be such a pussy. <sighs> Don't you think your power can be put to a better use? <laughs> okay. I think it's time for us to hit the road. You're not getting better. We're almost out of supplies. No, I'm okay. <coughs> it's just a cough. Yeah, a bad cough that won't go away. Trust me, Daniel. You need some medicine. Look, here. Beaver Creek? What's that? That's where Karen's parents... Our grandparents live. Okay. So what? So we can go there and... They'll probably help us. Why do you always force us to run, Sean? What if they... Don't like me? They're family, right? Plus, they owe us for what Karen... for what Mom did. Um... You sure? It would be cool to spend Christmas with our grandparents. Man, they're gonna love you. Grandpa's super cool, and... I'm sure you guys will be best buds. Well... Okay. But Mushroom has to agree, too. She's part of the team. What do you say, girl? <laughs> okay, when? Tomorrow. The sooner the better. We have a long road ahead. Hmm. We should do something fun for our last night here. How about a game of dice? If I win, I get to draw on your backpack. You know I'm gonna win and draw a dick on your bag, right? <laughs> I don't think so, pussy. Party time. Okay, ready to lose, Captain? Watch your butt, matey. Here we go. Just need a six, a five, and a four. Okay, got a ship. It's better than nothing. Come on, five. Yes, full ship. <laughs> Ahoy, Captain. More pirates. Hi. 
high score. How are you gonna beat that? Here you go, Cargo. <laughs> Good luck beating that, matey. Don't worry about that. All right, your turn. Yes! All right, I just need a four now. Come on, give me something, anything, phew. It was a close one. Ah, pretty good. Okay, let me throw now. Oh, shit. No. Nope. What the hell? I wonder what we would have done if we didn't find these dice. I don't know. Probably read all these books. Uh, boring. You remember that time I beat Dad at chess? <laughs> you mean we beat Dad? Yeah, you did help me distract them. <laughs> I bet he would have liked this game. <sighs> Definitely. He was a great pirate. Just like us. Captain Diaz, King of the Seas. Mm, okay, that will do. I need the score now. Pretty please. <sighs> Lame. Do you think Grandma and Grandpa will have a console? Uh. I don't think so, dude. Sorry. No biggie. I like playing dice and stuff, too. Whoa. Daniel the big nerd. Getting sick of screens. No way. It's nice for a change. But I still want my playbox. <laughs> yeah. I bet. I hope Noah is keeping our Minecraft fortress alive. For when I come back. I'm sure he is, pal. No way he gave up your super kingdom. Mushrooms growing up so fast. <laughs> really? I don't see much difference. Well, she's still a tiny dot, but I can tell she's getting older and smarter. You're a smart girl, right? <laughs> she's so cute. I love her forever. Yes, full ship. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Good job. And I win. Do you know what it means? <sighs> yeah, okay. You want it. Here's my bag. Mmm, let's see. Finish. A poop? Really? Yeah, it suits you. Well, thank you very much. So, let's do another one? It's bedtime. Gotta get up early. I'm gonna finish my comic book. <coughs> she has to pee. Okay, okay. I'll take her out for a walk. You're going to smoke. It smells like ass. You're right. Don't smoke. But it's our last night, so we can do anything. All right, all right. I heard you the first time, dude. <laughs> Thank you.
Hey, Daniel. How are you doing? It sucks. I'm coming. Mushroom wants to go out. Don't you hear? Yeah, sorry. Move. So, what's going on? It doesn't fit in. There's too much stuff. Fucking bullshit. Hey, cool down. It's gonna be okay. I know. But... What did you pack in? What the f... <sighs> Dude, you can't fit the whole room in. Don't worry. Your super strong big brother can help. Awesome. Thanks, Sean. Well, looks like we're almost set. Where's Mushroom? Still peeing, I guess? I'm gonna check what she's up to. <sighs> okay, I'll fill up our bottles and I'll catch up with you guys. Okay, all done. Where the hell is he? Daniel! Daniel! Hey, you out here? Daniel! Where is he? We have a two-day walk ahead of us. Better get going.
Daniel, where are you? What the fuck happened here? That's not good. Figure it out. <laughs> it's all right. I'm right here. Here, you should do it. Is that it? Well, unless you want to say something. You were such a good puppy. I'll always remember running through the snow with you and how you you snuggled. And I'll never forget you. Never. So long, True. You won't be forgotten. Sean, do you think she's up in heaven? With Dad? <sighs> yeah. I'm sure he will look after her. Wait. What about his allergies? <sighs> Don't worry, Inanna. There's no allergies up there. They'll be fine together. Okay. 
We should go. It's getting late. Sean. I'm sorry I killed the cat. I don't know what I was thinking. If only I could. I know. Come on, buddy.
<clears throat> we made it, Daniel. It's been a long time since I was here. When was that? Before you were born. Come here. Let me check you out. Claire likes everything super clean. Dad said she got pissed because he let me bring a snowball in the house. We don't want to look like total pigs. What if they went on vacation? Or, or, or something? We'll figure out something. I'm sorry, we don't want any of... Hello, Claire. Sean? Oh my... Is that... Daniel? What's going on out here? I heard... Look who's here! After all this time. What the hell are you doing here? Stephen, watch your mouth. Well... It's kind of a long story. <laughs> Oh, you poor thing. You know he's sick, right? Yeah, but... Okay, inside. Both of you. Is it, uh, warm enough for you? Oh, yeah. Feels nice and toasty. I gave Daniel some cough medicine, but you should have taken better care of him. He could have been worse. You were lucky. Stephen, may I talk to you for a second? Did I make a mistake coming here? Oh, Stephen, what are we going to do? I feel so awkward to be here. I remember that. Oh, shit. I'm so hungry, my belly hurts. It's good to be inside. Finally. I just hope they let us stay the night. Police officer was killed, Claire. You know, our grandchildren are wanted by the police for murder. I know. What if Sean is guilty, sleeping in our home next to us? Let's, let's just ask him what happened, and we'll figure something out. Okay? All right, Stephen. Oh Lord. Are you all right, honey? You want more tea? Thanks. I'm good. Uh, well, Sean, uh, do you want to talk about... Uh, uh... The police called us a few weeks ago. They're looking for you as suspects in a homicide and for assault and robbery in a gas station. Now, if you want us to help you, did you hurt that police officer in Seattle?
I don't know. I swear I don't. Too much happened and I'm trying to figure it out, but all I know is that he shot dead. And now he's gone. Oh, sweetie. We are so sorry for what happened to your father, but why did you run away if you're innocent? I didn't want Daniel to see Dad. Like that. I felt like I had to protect him. I understand, but... You know the police would separate us. Maybe forever. Daniel would end up in foster care. You, you can't be sure, Sean. Anyway, at least you've managed to come here alive. We're glad you two are okay. I hate to think what could have happened to both of you. You need to think of long-term solutions now. I tried. I swear. But I can't do everything. So... What are your plans? Go down to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. Dad has a family house there. Sean, you can't run away from the law like, like fugitives. How can you look out for your brother if you're both running from the police? You two are gonna stay with us. Oh, Stephen. Maybe we should... After your mother left, your dad...